What's up, BB fam? We gonna grind it out here again on these YouTube streets. A brand new year once again here on these YouTube streets. Not looking for fame, just doing our thing here on these YouTube streets. We going to mukbang it. Let's show some mad love here on these YouTube streets. With these delicious dishes, we're gonna blow your mind here on these YouTube streets. Setting our grind one bite at a time here on these YouTube streets. Popping beers and bottles. Painting our faces Everybody up like fat bitch models. Welcome to the freak show, the best in town. We here, oh, baby. Here I'm here on with these YouTube streets. I've been living in my own head, constantly yes, dark, sure. trouble ground. Think I need a little bottom in white. Hey, y'all. How's it going? Guess what? It's your boy, Vern Bang. Yes, it is your boy, Vern Bang. And we are back with another episode, honey. Yes, we got some B on deck, of course. Mm-hmm. Yes, we got a little slab of ribs. And we got this big, beautiful baby right here. With some of these uh, beautiful Spanish peppers. Mm-hmm. And honey. Let's go ahead and get God some glory before we get into everything we're going to do today. You know how we do it. Lord Jesus, thank you for this day. Thank you for everything you do in our life, Lord. I just want to pray for everybody in this whole wide world. Lord, put that extra comforting power. Anybody going through loss, let's put that triple, triple, triple power protection anointing on everybody in this whole wide world. Lord Jesus Christ, please shield them from anything that's going in their life and coming for them. And come, blood Jesus Christ. In your name I pray. Amen, amen, amen. Alrighty, y'all. So, we have got... Now, this has been a long time coming because I just finally found them. <laughs> but we have got a giant pig ear sandwich. <laughs> yes, honey. Uh-huh. Giant pig ear sandwich. Mustard. And we only got regular mustard. We got Dijon mustard. We got relish. We got some pickles. We got uh, a few tomatoes. We got a lot of onions sliced up. We got some uh, cheese. And we got some uh, lettuce as well. So... Sugar. <laughs> she is decked out, and you can really see that pig ear. Look at that pig ear. Oh, look at that. Look at that. It's going to be good. But before we get into all this, <laughs> I got this little slab of rib left. So I did ribs on my birthday. I know I was supposed to come back on a birthday video, but I was enjoying them too much. <laughs> So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. And these ribs came out so perfect. Oh, my God. Tend to fender benders. I'll show you up close. Mmm. Mmm. And they're just little oven-made ribs because we ain't got a grill. They come out so good. <laughs> and my nerve. <laughs> I did marinate them for a couple days. Mm-hmm. Really let that flavor sink in. Mm. They're a busting. Mm-hmm. And this was the last piece that was left. Because <laughs> I weighed the whole rack. Uh-huh. And I would say the rack is a full spare rib. So it's like from here 
to about here and about this wide. Mm hmm. We put our uh, foot in it. And our mouths. And <laughs> me and mom was like, because we hadn't had ribs in a while. It was like, <laughs> uh uh, get down. Sorry, y'all. Get down. Sweetie, get down. Down. Oh my god, these cats are going to be the death of me. Here we go. Lord have mercy. They love the rips too, so. I just don't want to appear there by my camera. <laughs> anyway, sorry. <laughs> but baby, sorry of being rude. <laughs> How are y'all doing? What y'all eating with me? <laughs> Let me know if there's something you hadn't had in a long time that you grabbed on this weekend or <laughs> in the last couple of weeks that just <laughs> mm. made you feel exactly like this. <laughs> Baby. <laughs> and I got a whole nother rib <laughs> in the freezer. <laughs> Which I had to cut it in half into two packages to fit in our little, because our freezer is little. It's like the mobile home freezers. They're like really small. But yeah. And I got a couple packs of pig ears. <laughs> That's for sure. I sure did. And I cooked my first pack up. And I don't know if I want to cut this or not. It's just like... I know sometimes it's damn if you do, damn if you don't. So... You might as well. This is a big ass piece of bread. Oh my god. <laughs> Let me move this over. No way. Oh yeah. Let me <laughs> put some of these out over here. <laughs> so people saying I ain't put it on my dirty ass table. Mind your business. <laughs> mm hmm Please do. Alrighty. So let's go ahead and <laughs> let's see. I guess we can put one up like this and grab the other one from the bed. Mm. Oh my god. Can you see that? <laughs> Lord have mercy. Look at that. Oh, ain't that ridiculous? <laughs> Come on, Lips. Get your bite. Get your burn bang bite. Come on, Lips. I know my brother from another mother. Lips. Mm-hmm. He loves pig ears. That's his favorite meat. And it's been becoming one of my favorite meats because I made it a long time ago. And you can go back on my own videos like, this is the home of the pig ear sandwich. Boom. And you see why. <laughs> uh huh. Because I make them 15 million ways. This is the home of the pig ear sandwich. And then Lips is the home of the pig ear. He loves them with stewed tomatoes and rutabagas and collards and anything else in between. And then he usually eats with fresh onion. Mm hmm. So. You better get you a bite. Cheers, y'all. Mm. 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 Mm.
no cheese ball. <laughs> A little cheesy onion pull. <laughs> okay. And I normally don't put lettuce, but I was like, well, let's try it with a little lettuce. And try to be a little healthy. Herbs. Mind your business. <laughs> Mm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, my God. These pig ears came out bomb. <laughs> yeah, I put them on my Instapot. Season them up proper. Mm. Mm. They are tender from the bender. Mm hmm. Let me go ahead and switch napkins. <laughs> But wow, that soft bread, oh my God. Now, I always forget what type of pepper these are, but these are like Spain. I'll have to look them up. I should have looked them up, but I've been lazy. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Which I'm thinking is the Spanish one, but I don't know. Got a little kick, kick, kick. Mm-hmm. Now I did get them at the Asian store, but they're not the big Asian ones that you normally see. Hello, VB friends. If How y'all like doing? I love y'all. Most of them are green, some of them turn yellow. But I always forget. Mm. Mm. Wow. <laughs> if you ain't never had a pig ear sandwich, I highly suggest you try one. Mm hmm. Especially if you're a pork lover. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Charge me because you be like all the pork. You like them pork bait, you like them jiggly bits. When you cook these to the proper stuff, they just melt in your mouth. They're just like. Mm hmm. Melt in your mouth. Wow. So, yeah, I was able to get my. Uh, Nephew-in-law Bobby take me to the Asian store because I had to get some stuff from my my neighbor or my landlord and uh, So he was able to take me and then I was able to get the They didn't have fresh ones, but they had frozen ones. So I was like, hey frozen butter and nothing Oh my god, they had the most beautiful beef tin and like everything is so expensive And when we went Earlier this week, they still had not proved my food stamps. And they still have not sent me nothing saying whether they approved them or not. But I look on Amazon. Or you can look at Walmart.com and look up your uh, balance. So I looked today and 
lo and behold, the money was there, and I'm like, really? But it wasn't there on the, you know, the normal day it's supposed to be there, so. I was like, they must have just approved it, so. We'll be able to go get more delicious treats from the Korean store. As well as everybody else. Or, or everywhere else. That's reasonable. But. I've just been craving me some Korean food. But some soul food. And not the soul food you can get at the Korean store. So. <laughs> and this is one of them. Mmm. Mm-mm. Yep. See? Look at that bite. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 My baby. Oh, MG. <laughs> wow. And for me, it's the onion, the mustard. I can take or not take the lettuce. Oh. Matter of fact, next time I probably won't do lettuce. But this time, I also put something else that I forgot to tell you about. Uh huh. I also stuck my collard greens on there. Uh huh. Yeah, so we got mustard on both sides, Dijon and regular, uh-huh, onions on both sides. We got a few diced tomatoes, not too many. We got some lettuce, too much lettuce probably, uh-huh. And then I put all my collard greens on the bottom bone, just piled it up, and baby, <laughs> let me tell you, that lip smacking good. Yeah, because these definitely got, like, the pig feet quality, the gelatinous. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. I don't know. I'm just eating off the table like a pig. I had to vacuum up in a little bit. <laughs> That's for sure. Mm. But anyway, so hopefully you are having a beautiful start to the weekend. It is Friday. Friday, baby. Mm -hmm. We're going to start cranking out some more videos. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Yep. Oh. And that pepper is hot. I gotta look it up, see what kind of pepper this is, but I think I still got the receipt. But and this has definitely got a kick to it. But I was thinking it was these uh, Spanish peppers that you like can fry in oil and season them up. Is what I was thinking they are, but maybe these got some. Some good little heat to it. Oh yeah. Woo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> give me another bite. <laughs> mm. But it looks so pretty in all the layers. Mm hmm. It's so gorgeous. I just hope y'all enjoyed this video as much as I did. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. We're starting to get a few things out of our storage to get Halloween kicked off. But yes, y'all. Yeah, these are these got a kick to it. 
I'm gonna have to look them up. <laughs> Yeah, and those babies, they got that much kick till you start frying them, they're going to concentrate the heat. So, I have to figure out what to do with them, but they definitely got a, like you kind of taste it like in the back of your throat, but then it becomes frontal. So it's like two stages, like you taste it, you swallow it. And then you feel some heat in the back, and then it comes. But I gotta look those peppers up. They're very, very good. And like, if you have an H mark, and they're like these little crinkly peppers looking things. But I'll find out what they are. Anyways, at this point, I'm just rambling on. I'm just coming with a little quick uh, video for you right now. And we'll be coming back later for something else, so... Anyways, y'all, uh, you do you. Sugar, I already know you're going to be the best you. Never let anybody change you. Yes, honey, because you, 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 hey, pay attention back there, even you, mm -hmm. are perfect. Yes. The way we are, honey. We are perfect just the way we are. And stay tuned because you ain't never know what you're going to hear or see over here on this TV. Mm-hmm. On this channel. Period. And guess what? You've been... Ah, Vern Bang! Yes, honey, you've been Vern Bang once again. Yes. And we are going to... Put this up for now and we'll be back later to eat it trust me ain't never nothing in this house ever goes to waste <laughs> never <laughs> and guess what Peace. catch you on another one